what up for carrots? I'm back once again with a new video and today I'm doing a mental health day. I'm tired, stressed, I wanna get I wanna redo my room, I wanna paint my walls, I wanna do all that. But I'm I'm a broke teen. I'm a broke teenager. I have no money on, no profit, no money on, no profit. We just gonna jump into the video, mental health day. So y'all come on with me. Now before I start, I wanna light this candle real quick. It's a Bath and Body Works candle, y'all. Mm -hmm. I gotta get me a picture. Thumbnail pictures. Gotta get them thumbnail pictures. Hold up, y'all. Bruh. I think I should use this one or this one. Okay, y'all, so this is what I wash up with. I wash up with Dove coconut and cocoa butter scented body wash. And I use my exfoliating glove with my turmeric soap. I'm gonna go ahead and get in the shower. I'm gonna tune in with y'all when I get out because this is a mental health day. I'm gonna relax. I'm gonna talk to y'all like just a little bit. And then, yeah. Okay, y'all, I'm fresh out the shower. I needed that hot, steaming shower. I needed that. So, y'all, I'm not doing nothing big or nothing. I'm just gonna wear some white socks. I'm just gonna put some drawers on. None, none too big. I'm not putting no pajama set on. I don't feel like sweating in my sleep. I'm just wearing a basic regular shirt. I want to show y'all what I grease my body up with. It's actually a mixture of three things. It's a mixture of Vaseline, baby oil, and Hans. Let me show y'all what I'm talking about. So, maybe some of y'all may be a little clueless. This. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I'll get back to y'all once I'm done greasing my body up so we can have this little chat I said we're going to talk about. Okay, y'all. I'm fresh out of the shower. I feel good, y'all. My body feel real relaxed. I want to have a conversation with y'all because I had left YouTube for, um... I had left YouTube for, um... Damn. I don't remember how long I left YouTube, how long I left y'all here just waiting. Like before I had left, I had like a good amount of views and likes on almost every single one of my videos that I had posted. I left YouTube for four months. I'm gonna keep it like 100% with y'all. I'm not even finna sit up here in front of y'all face. I was dead just being lazy. I just really low key did not want to get up and like be consistent with it. I didn't feel like doing nothing. I did not feel like getting on my MacBook, editing the whole video, adding little memes in there if I said things wrong, doing all that other stuff. As my foot was being transferred, the adapter thing, I had to pop up the image, but then the video would play for like just a little bit, and then the rest of the video would go mute. And I'm like, is my camera messing up? Is it uh, iMovie? Is it my computer? Is it not? transferring from the sim card to the computer if, am i not downloading it right it was a whole bunch of stuff i was doing i was doing research on video i was doing researches on youtube to see what was going on really ain't nothing pop up but tips and tricks on editing on iMovie and that was not what i was looking for iMovie messing up not fully dragging in all my audio for my videos also stopped me from doing it also me picking up my camera and wanting to film it just stopped me from doing it I was being lazy, like I already said, didn't want to edit, didn't want to edit, didn't want to film, didn't want to do nothing. So those four months was like a little break for me. And I don't even feel like I really needed a break. I just feel like I needed to have the energy to do it. So that was number one reason why I left. I left because I was being lazy. Number two, I didn't have no video ideas. I didn't have no, like none, nada. No video ideas of what I wanted to post. I couldn't keep making videos in the house, not doing nothing. I'm like, ain't nobody finna watch this, Javaris. I didn't know what I wanted to post. It was like, I didn't really do nothing. It was boring for me. I thought me becoming viral on YouTube was not gonna happen. But I didn't have no patience. Um, I was not hyping myself up enough. And I was not um, giving myself the right support system. So, now that I'm back and I feel like I'm ready to actually do it again, um, I feel like I got better things coming. I even made a list on my phone of um, YouTube ideas that I can do. Here y'all. 
Uh, make sure it's focusing. YouTube ideas, and there's 20 on here. I'm going to read a couple of these off to y'all for my YouTube ideas. So, I want a routine, clean up with me, come shopping with me, um, spend a day with me, new groom transformation, hygiene shopping, come to school with me, let's go summer shopping, come with me to my dad's house, I let's reorganize my room, get ready with me for school, uh, let's go back to school shopping, 4th of July vlog, nightly routine, my bath routine, let's go shoe shopping, blessing my mom for Mother's Day next year. That's my main goal. Like, I don't care about nothing else. Like, room decor I want, paint my room with me, and then at the bottom I got another q and A. I feel like it's good to do repeated Q&As. Not repeated, repeated, but I feel like it's good to do a couple of... So, them really everything I got, you know, 20 YouTube ideas that I'm going to do. And today, um... I know it's a my bath routine, but I'm going to count this mental health video as that because I basically took a bath. So, as I go on and I do a video and I edit a video and I post it, I will go and I will hit the little circle box and it'll show a check mark. And it'll show a check mark for that you completed your task. So, I feel like this might keep me in a habit of um, staying consistent. I want that I want to get every little box with a check marking it so it should keep me in the habit plan on having better content and being more consistent with y'all and um show my appreciation because i didn't get 43 followers out of nowhere i got 43 followers out of me grinding and hustling for what i want i want to say hustling but i was grinding for what i wanted which was to grow my youtube channel everybody know the new curriculum to um be a professional youtuber is 500 subscribers so that's my goal right now is to get to 500 subscribers. I'm going to continue to pro promote myself on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. I'm hold up, y'all. My throat is dry. I just sound like I'm about to cry, and I'm not. Okay. Stop it. Get some help. Damn! Bruh. Get my motherfucking face if you want to, bitch. Sorry, yeah, that's inappropriate of me. Yeah, let me just tell y'all something like rude awakening like real quick. This topic that I'm talking about right now is way off of what I was even talking about to begin with. I'm talking about how TikTok shut down and how I just got 2,000 followers for no reason. And I don't feel like I should continue to grind on TikTok because it's not going to help me in no way. Because they said they finna ban it. So what's the point? So you was going to be confused on what I was talking about. I had done switch the topic into TikTok. And I was saying, like, okay, what's Elon Musk doing? I know he's he, I know he probably watching the news. I'm, I'm pretty sure he's a guy that want to keep up with uh, what's going on in the world and the society. He rich. He a billionaire. He made Tesla. You know, I was just having thoughts yesterday about, okay, he bought Twitter and named it X. He better buy TikTok and name it Y. I mean, come on now. I need TikTok. I don't care what the name is. It ain't got to be TikTok. It could be Y. Like I just said, it could be Y. I need TikTok. This is the end of this video. Make sure I give this video a big thumbs up. Like, comment, share, subscribe. And when you subscribe, hit the notification bell on the side. So next time I make a new video, you'll get a notification. Bye, y'all.